Jay Ahern, I'm, I'm currently a principal and a partner in the Chertoff Group, a risk management firm in Washington, D.C. I've uh, been there for eight years after spending 33 years in federal law enforcement. For the last couple of years before I retired, I was the, the Commissioner of Customs and Border Protection and the Deputy Commissioner, which is 60,000 person federal law enforcement organization. And we went through many different challenges over the year to bring in additional personnel as we looked to secure the homeland and had to do that in rapid fashion with some of the hiring. So we needed to make the right suitability determinations on people that we were bringing into the organization. Everyone, whether it be in law enforcement, whether it be in the United States or globally, or whether it be people in the financial sector or even in the retail sector, everyone's concerned about how to go ahead and protect themselves. Whether it be from a cyber threat, there'll be technologies to be able to go ahead and detect what penetrations may be attempting against a network. And when you're looking to secure a physical perimeter, you'll have fences and cameras and sensors to be able to protect. People are now taking a look at how do you actually protect against insider threats. And an insider threat can certainly unravel an organization, whether it be a law enforcement entity or a commercial enterprise, and particularly financial sectors for, for one. So being able to take a look at people in the hiring process, making the right decisions, making the correct suitability determinations is key. So using a capability like iDetect is very important going forward. And some of the other capabilities that, that certainly the Converis has brought on board too will add a suite of of technology that are cheap, efficient, effective solutions that can be brought on relatively swiftly and be able to mitigate some of the risks. Not eliminate, but mitigate some of the risks of, of the insiders. You know, it's, it's not so much only about the leakers. You know, it certainly is, is people that could be providing insider information that could go ahead and give, whether it be on trading or whether it be a financial aspect, but people that actually damage the brand or the reputation of companies in all ways, whether it be someone that could give physical access to something to a, a nuclear site or an energy site, or certainly in the financial sector, giving ins inside information about account information, that kind of stuff. But also as far as in the law enforcement or intelligence community, you don't want to have someone that goes ahead and gives some of the protected secrets that governments around the world try so hard to protect. You need to have a dynamic and evolving company that can actually stay in step with the threats of today, and more importantly, looking around the corner to what tomorrow's threats are. Converis has demonstrated certainly that it's very adaptable and very innovative to deal with today as well as tomorrow's threats.